girlfriend was about to experience the effects of Pollution X-23. The nightmare gas. You will now take her place. Glad to be a service. But there could be a snag. Oh? It is possible that I told the police exactly where I am. Even now they could be surrounding the window. <laughs> we will know immediately, Tara. We have a very efficient early warning system. I think you came with a companion. My brother will speak to him later. In the meantime... Help! Oh, yes, the gas is already having its effect on him. Tara, is as good as dead. Dead. Are there two of them? Yes. Then go outside and get the other one. These? Oh, they're quite safe. Oh, yeah. The antidote is still in Tara's flat. But my ticket will be a million miles away. No one could possibly get to him in time. The body will live for another 22 minutes and 40 seconds. So where did his mind have started out on its own last terrifying journey? What does he say? Something about the tavern or the picture. The gas. Look at his clothes. Ah, oh, Roy, let's indulge in these fans. Puppy days. All of them. Oh, that's a very strange dog. Get a dog down there. I'm a couple of stone boys. So, now get on your feet and die like a man. You heard the charging? No! That's a fine day's work. You're the third we've caught tonight. Well, there will be three less to call his millions to worry over. And what fancy name do you go by to match those fancy clothes, Royalist? My name is Terry. And it's no good first, no doubt. No, not particularly. So we finish your mere frogging. We won't have every right. The order states that anyone out after curfew, say General Cromwell's own soldiers, must die. Cromwell? And the general doesn't stop for his orders, to be disobeyed. So let's cut him down here and now, and be done with it. In a few more minutes, the gas will appear. It'll be safe to go in there. I shall have to test his pulse rate. I know his heartbeat should be rising rapidly. I wonder where his unconscious mind has taken him. You're enjoying it, aren't you? That's a means to an end. What end? In a little while, a man will be coming here. Like a merchandise broker. Is that? Yes. Our own government is far too squeamish for you to listen to 23. Fortunately, there are other governments whose conscience is then trouble and question. For years now, people have assumed that the nuclear bomb was the ultimate weapon. But they're wrong. H-23 is the final deterrent. Who would fight against it? Nightmare. Who could fight against it? Nightmare. Yes, I was just thinking. Your brother is taking a long time, isn't he? When Dardiac is on the prowl, no one will meet him. That's fair. Well, there'll be no last minute of sleep for either of them. This isn't really happening. I must remember that. It's not really happening. It's so real. It's so vivid. It's so difficult. I can just keep my wits about me. It's like that. 
And he lost all over the people to run your place. Sergeant. Yeah. The dying man is often granted the last request, isn't he? Who do you take the station as feeling blind? General Cromwell's soldiers are honorable men. This is so I've read. Uh, but he wants. Uh, let me see. Yes, the last meal. You know, the condemned man has a hearty breakfast. That's the traditional. He's making a fool of us. Oh, no, no, I'm not that. I assure you. As a matter of fact, I brought my own food. I think I'm on a fancy. A hard boiled thing. Perhaps. Two. What's that? No, no. It's an illusion. Light. It's an illusion. It's a demon. What sorcery is this? It's called Le Day de Man. Now you see it. Now you don't. It's like on the devil. It's like the thing is still with my own eyes. It is our Lord, your Lord. You must be held for inquisitor general. Not no soul to end your life, Warlock. It will be a plane but the state. Take the letter. Inform the inquisitor general. We've got a royalist war off for him. Slowly. Rich. Oh, you know the other prisoners, eh? No, no, I, I don't have it. Oh, well, let me refresh your memory. This is Sir Richard Winthrop, alchemist to the king. And the woman is Lady Lillian, a court favourite. <laughs> and you mean, sir? Carol, Carol, that has a foreign ring to it, sir. No matter. We are all companions in adversity, are we not? No, no. Now that is very strange. Indeed. Hey, this is so impossible, you. It's so you were finding up the end of the parliament. Of course, you mean. Yes. Yeah. But that is a private name. My name is my family and friends. Well, then perhaps I'm among the latter. What very happy for me, you know. Oh, that's a welcome sight. Failure. You know Mr. Failure too, do you? Yes, yeah, like as not you protect you too, sir. Hold your tongue. Mr. Failure is a faithful servant of General Cromwell and the new Commonwealth. And chief informer to the Inquisitor General. Whose name is? It is said his enemies dare not speak his name. Did you hear it as you perish before his vengeance? That one is so stern as the state, Mr. Failure. <laughs> He's a sorcerer. <laughs> Why are you here? We are praising the glass of your sir. Well, thanks for the call. Come near to His Majesty, like yourself. Well, not exactly. I'm rather more of an intellect. But let him fight against General Cromwell. He said, I have no fear. I have no fear. It is about his tension, said that. They say the king is already marching against him. What news for you? Sir? Oh, well, I have nothing. I was just musing. I wonder, could you please tell me, has the Battle of Maysby been fought yet? Maysby? I've not heard of it. We have a great victory at Kitchfield. Two of the defeated the bandits and drove them from the field. Our fortunes are already on the turn. Not if I remember my history. Yes. I do seem to know your face. Really? Think of the name Tara. Think hard. Concentrate. I've got to get a message through to you. Is there a dispatch for the king? No, no. Concentrate, Lily. Concentrate. Hotel is trying to contact you. Tarot? Tarot. Concentrate. Yes. Yes. I know that name. That thing. Listen, I must tell you. Sam is somewhere outside. Tell him that the answer is. They're plotting something. Plotting? <laughs> they ought to be changing words! <laughs> I love that. Sorry. How long have I got? Not long. Not long.
the better of my brother. Come. Well, your would-be rescuer is the one person who's been spared the horrors of the lieutenant's twenty feet. At least his death was sharp and sudden. Not like your friend Tarot. Oh, that was a musket shot. Someone's death was sharp and sudden. Not like yours would be, Master Tarot. You'll see the hand of soldiers. Hey, you'll see the hand of Ah, Tommy. What's really happened, that shot? There are many gunshots to be heard in London these days, sir. And we're used to the violence and the bloodshed. General Cromwell has much to answer for. Listen, we must try to escape. If we stay here, I'm here, the general will be with you. Well, you heard what they told me. Slaughter off. Let's see if I can live up to my name. I find this cabin dreadfully dull. Bear wouldn't say this, bear wouldn't draw. What this place needs is some excitement. Don't you agree? Say no more! Beware the power of the black magician, eh? Make the one quick. Now, come here. I said, hurry! Oh, it's magic. No, it's not. I assure you, it's only an illusion. Let's sit down with him now. If we don't, he's cut the ball. No, you can't. You can't. It's not time yet. Kill him. No. Did they take to kill one cavalier? Sam! Right, first time. How's your luck? Sam! Sergeant Max is, sir, of the King's Royal Regiment of Lifeguards. That's your service. I'm never around it. Where's my brother? The blonde gorilla? Outside. You killed him? No, but he's having a little kick. Now just keep your distance and let's get things sorted out here. Where's Tara, lovely? Um, Sam, Sam, he's dying in there. Dying? So Justin with H23. Sam, you only have a few minutes on this. Sam, leave me. Give you some big towel. You can do nothing without the antidote. Antidote? That's all bottle. Oh, yeah, the last time I saw that was in Tara's hand. He may have put me a Go on, look, Sam, hurry. Lead the way. You're wasting your time. Move. I can't hear you. I can't hear anyone. Only the voices that speak a little nightmare. Nothing. You mean to tell me with all this gear there's nothing? Nothing. Only the antidote can bring him out of that coma. Sam! The bottle's in the corner! Look at my finger, I'm pointing at it! The antidote is in the corner! What was that? This is no time for refreshment. 
you find it? No, there wasn't any topic. It must be to look flat. There's well, no time to get it. I'll try it, Sam, will you? Right. Flat! Oh. I'm right beside you. <laughs> Somewhere. Hurry, Lily! Hurry! Uh, 
strength, cavalier, and bear yourself like a true soldier of the king. Hurry. Why? They're not going anywhere. Look.